Hi guys, this is Connie. I am here with a Shopco haul for you today. Um, it's a rather large one, so um, sit down and relax. I've got a little story to tell you too about, about them. Um, once I get to the items, I'll tell you. I wasn't very happy with them. I'm still not. Uh, I spent, this is a $170 haul. So anyway, um, I returned, I wanted to tell you, first of all, never mind, I'll tell you later. Okay, first bag. Um, I got a little money, so I went on a little bit of retail, retail therapy type stuff. Um, been a little depressed, been a little anxious, been a little this and that lately. Um, so I, I did pay my bills, did that first. Caught up on my rent, caught up on my cable, caught up, you know, all this stuff, kind of stuff. So, and then I went out and I did a little shopping on things that I really wanted, but I just did, you know, uh, didn't have the money for or whatever, you know, before. So, um, anyway, this one is a Gramercy Park. It's a faux fur to micro light throw, and it's 50 by 60. Isn't that beautiful? And Oh my God, it is so soft. So pretty. They had all different um, shades of this, and I really like this color the best. But it's so soft and so pretty. So, okay, there's that. Um, next, I got this here I paid $18 for. But I really like these, and I am kind of a pajama or a nightgown a holic. Um, I have got a lot of nightgowns. But this is just a um, just a nightgown, long sleeve nightgown for this winter. And it is one of those that I just I just love these kind. Where in the hell's the tag? It is a cool girl. The cool girl checklist. Cool. One technology wicks away moisture. Comfortable. Our soft fabric feels as good as it looks. Cute because you are. Cool girl does it all just like you enjoy. And this was normally $37.99 and I got it for $18. It was on sale. So, okay. Their clothes are rather expensive. Okay, that was the first bag. I thought I had more. Oh, there's another bag in here. Never mind. Okay. Let's let's see here. We're crying out loud. Okay. I can tell you these two shirts I tried to exchange. This is the owl one I was wearing last week. And then this one here um, has got butterflies and stuff on it. Well, um, if you're seeing them, you know I couldn't exchange them. Anyway, um, I took another one back that I had the tags for. I did not have the tags for those. I took that one back, and I got my money back. It was um, like almost $15. And then I took a bra back that was $15. So I exchanged those two things. Then they tried to look these up, and they said they, they looked and looked and looked, and I mean, I was in that store for two hours. I am not kidding you. I was so pissed, and so the steam was coming out of my ears by the time I left, believe me. And she heard about it. Anyway, um, when I first went up there, I'll, I'll start from the beginning. When I first, you know, was going to check out, I'd been in there, in the store probably about 45 minutes, maybe. Um and got all this stuff. So I went to the service desk because I had that stuff to return. And I thought, well, I'm going to return it and might as well just get my stuff while, while I'm there, which was a huge mistake. Um, anyway, she returned the two items that she could. And then she decided she had rung all this stuff up. So then she decided she was going to go look up those other shirts. While doing that, the till shut off. So she had to re-ring all my stuff. Then she went back to look. She it did it again. She had to re-ring all these items three times. I was so pissed. Anyway, she called up a lady. The lady says, go ahead and just return it for the, you know, with the tickets for the other 
other items. I did not have a receipt for the shirts. Uh, she says, okay, well, we can't really do that because you haven't bought these other items. I said, well, let's buy them and then go and return to them. Right? Well, she wouldn't do that. So she went through and she looked and looked and looked for the UPC codes and stuff for those two shirts. She couldn't find them. She, she called up another lady. That lady says, well, you had to have bought them over six months ago. I said, I did not. I know that I bought them right before July 4th um, because I wore that first one on July to the picnic or to the parade, the July 4th parade, and I had just bought it. That's not six months ago. Well, they couldn't find them, so they wouldn't return them. So I called a manager yesterday, and they said to bring in my receipt. Guess what? Um, I spilled a glass of pop at work yesterday. It went into my purse. The receipt is ruined. I can't. I can't. I'm so pissed. <laughs> so now I'm stuck with those shirts. They're, I just wanted to size up one size because I just I didn't like the way they looked on my sides. I thought they looked a little bit tight. So anyway, there's my horror story for Shopko. I mean, we all have those kind of stories for, you know, at stores, you know. So anyway, I got some Glad Force Flex trash bags. Um, these are Tall Kitchen, 72 of them. And I wish I had my receipt because I was going to tell you how much everything cost. But I don't. And I got a... a Another warmer. Um, this one is a deluxe dual warmer. And it's for, let's see here. It's perfect for, you can use it for candles. I will show you it first. What you can see of it. Let's, let's just take it out of the package. Because I'm going to use it anyway. Should have done this first. I'm sorry about that. Okay, so let's put this together again so I can read to you and show you what I mean. Okay, so it goes on there like that. Isn't that pretty? It's just pretty. Um, but you can use it here. It's got a warmer that you can use for candles. You can put cubes in here like this. And you can put oil in here to heat oil, which I have lots of. I just thought that was ingenious. And I got this um, for $10. Got this for $10. And I got another one that's a little owl-shaped one that you plug into the wall. It's out in my car. Um, I'm going to take it to work. That I got for $6 on clearance. These, these here were on clearance. Isn't that gorgeous, though? I just think that's so pretty. It's really different. I've never, I don't think I've ever seen one like this. So anyway, let's put this stuff back in the sack. And it's also got a, so you don't have to unplug it all the time. It's got a um, thing where you can turn it on and off, which I really like. Because um, my, my diffusers, I have to unplug all the time. And I don't really appreciate that. So, all right. One more sack from them. I'm going to leave my diffuser up here, or my candle thing up here, because I don't want it to break. Okay, so I got some clothes, as you know. I also got some more. I got these there the other day, and these are kind of small size. I like the larger ones. These are Conair Lift and Design. Lift and Desi Define, sorry. Uh, great create volume in all hair types, and there are three of them. They're microband antro my, microbial product protection. Okay, so I'll show you my clothes. This is the first one, and I really, really wanted this. This is the whole reason I did my haul. Um, only in the couple of days since I'd seen it last, the ones I really wanted were gone. 
There was a um, black and white one, and there was a gray and white one that I wanted. Um, just flannel shirts. I love flannel shirts for fall, but I don't have any. And then the, these have the lace on the top, on the shoulders, and on the top and the back. And these were on sale for $19. They're usually $35.99, and I got it for $19. Okay, so there's that one. Here's another one that I got for $3.59. I love this kind of stuff. For work, these are great. Kind of almost like Aztec or Indian type design. Okay, so these are the new shirts that I got to replace my other ones. These are the only ones that they had left that I liked. Um, this one here has flowers on it. And these are the size I wanted. Got that one. Got which I like gray. This one here has got like daisies or something on it. Um, okay, and one more, which is a brown. Um, I don't love brown, but I thought this design was really pretty. Okay, but they'll be perfect for work, um, and I can wear them underneath my flannel shirt. Okay, just a couple more things in here, and then we're done. Um, I got some wax melts there, too, because they were $2. Um, this is Tuscany Candle Sun Washed Cotton. I love clean, fresh smells, so this is going to be awesome. I got two of them. What did they do with the other one? There it is. And this one is fresh linen. I love those smells. Um, this is um, colored pencils for my coloring book. Plus, I have more in my other room um, that I got quite a while ago. There's no sharpening in these. Just twist up the fun. There's 18 of them. Um, I got, these were a little bit more expensive than the regular colored pencils, like a dollar more, I think. But I thought, no sharpening. This is awesome. Okay, the next are makeup items. Surprise, surprise. Okay, and I'm going to wash off my hand of the other, where's my wet wipe, um, of the other stuff that I hauled earlier, so I can swatch stuff for you. Okay, first thing I got was I found the Maybelline Brow Drama, um, sculpted brows, and I got it in... soft brown. So I'm kind of excited to use that. The next thing is, um, I just, I don't have any concealer that I like. So I thought I would try another one. Um, and I'm going to keep trying them until I find one I like. This one is Maybelline in Light Super Stay Better Skin Concealer. Uh, targets Dark Circles, Spots, Imperfections. And that's what that looks like. I'm going to try this. Okay, the last rest are, can you guess? Lipsticks! All right, first one I got, I got two Kate, um, Kate by Rimmel. And this one here is in the red packaging. Um, I can't remember which one is the matte. This is one of, color 104. It doesn't say on here, but I think that's such cute packaging. Um, anyway, color 104, and it's absolutely lovely. And they're, you're going to find that they're all a little similar. Because I'm right now I'm really into the mauves again. Isn't that pretty? That is so pretty. All right, the, the other one is in the black. And this one is in color... It's either 08 or 80. I don't know. <laughs> Look how similar they are. You know, they're just off by a shade or so, you know. 
One is um, their mat, though. And I'm kind of thinking it's a red package. Okay, the next one is by Lori L. And this is color 560 Saucy Moth. Saucy, saucy, saucy. Oh, that's sassy for... <laughs> and it's in a really pretty gold packaging. <laughs> so funny seeing them together. Because they're all just a tiny bit... I mean, you can tell a tiny bit difference, but they're all so close. I don't care. I love that color. Okay, and the other one is one I'd never seen before in the stores. This is um, a nude line by all these, like there's, I think there's five or six celebrities that this is their favorite color of nude. And I got the Julianne, uh, which is Julianne, what's her last name? She was in the, um, I believe she was in the, not Die Hard, Bruce Willis, um, or was it Die Hard? No, it wasn't Die Hard. It, it was, um, it wasn't Bruce Willis either. It was Mel, Mel, God dang it. Words just escape me. The, um, you guys tell me. She was in the, with Mel um, Gibson in, um, there was a bunch of different, Lethal Weapon. Lethal Weapon. She was his wife, I believe. His second wife, I believe. The first one died, and then he got married again to, or he was going with this girl or something. Anyway, she was, it, and she's got red hair, um, Julianne. I cannot, more? Is it more? Anyway, this is her lipstick, and it's Collection Privy by Julianne. And it's got kind of a, oh, just a really kind of sleek feel, um, kind of rubberized type. I, I can't describe it very well. But this is color 620, Julianne's Nude. And I just, I thought this was beautiful. Some of them were too pink. Some of them were too, um, they had like um, J-Lo's, if you, if you know what she usually wears. Now, that color does not suit me at all. But she's got the Latino skin. So, okay, so this is what it looks like. Just kind of a light pink. It's very pretty, though, I think. I have not tried any of these on. But look at how similar those first three are. I mean, I can tell even with the camera that they're a little, you know, there's a shade difference in between each of them. But um, that nude is so pretty. But they've got like five of them. They've, I, I don't even know who, who a couple of the people were. I wish I, I think it's Julianne Moore is her name. Correct me if I'm wrong, if any of you know who I'm talking about. Um, I should have did a little research before I did this. <laughs> but anyway, that is my huge haul. I also got a couple other things. I got um, a few grocery items that I didn't put in here. Um... I got a big thing of kitty litter. Excuse me, I feel like I have a hair. Um, that kind of stuff. There was a few things. Uh, anyway, um, even with the two re returns, it still was a $175 haul. So, And I've got a couple more hauls coming. I've got a couple things from Amazon. I've got um, a Ulta haul and a Sephora haul that I don't have yet. So... Um, look for those coming up. I do have one more to do today to pre-record. So if you like these kind of things, if you like these hauls, please let me know by giving me a thumbs up. Um, tell me what you think of the hair. Brutally honest, but not mean. Okay? Love you guys. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.